All right, I got to stop that for a moment. I want to bring this up. Um, I'm going to say this real quick. Uh, as I'm sure most people know, Raquel Welch passed away yesterday. And I think she was 80, uh, 82, I think. But uh, I was always a fan. And, and here's why. I mean, I remember... This is my personal story about Raquel Welch, and I've never forgotten this. Uh, when I was a kid, I was at my grandmother's house. We all went to visit my grandmother one summer. And, you know, people were sitting around talking or whatever. There was a magazine that was uh, next to the couch, and nobody was talking to me. So I picked up this magazine, and I started looking through it, and there was a, I found a picture in there of Raquel Welch from the movie, it was a movie still from One Million Years B.C., from a movie she was in called One Million Years B.C., and when I saw that picture, I, I remember this clear as day, sitting there on the couch looking at this picture of Raquel Welch from, you know, whenever that movie was, One Million Years B.C., and when I looked at it, that was the moment in my life that I knew I liked girls. It was a defining moment. <laughs> Looking at her picture, I knew from that moment on that I liked at, at that moment that I liked girls. She was the quintessential woman. What they should do to honor her is in every dictionary that comes out from now on, when they put the definition of the term woman, they should put her picture because she was just a quintessential definition of. Uh, both physically and mentally and emotionally, she was a well-rounded human being too. I read about her, you know, a lot because I was a fan. I was a fan. I read about her a lot. She was a just a good human being as well. So anyway, um, that's my moment on uh, Raquel Welch. Now let me go to Smash. People are always uh, surprised at how bright you are because they think, well, if anyone who's a sex symbol automatically has to be dumb for some reason and just hasn't turned yeah. out that way in your case. Well, it's very nice but, of you to say so, but I don't care about yeah. proving anything yeah. one way or the other. Well, that's good. 